¿Qué tal mi familia? Mi nombre es Ruben Kings y aquí vamos a jugar Super Mario Sunshine. This is now in Spanish, but it's still in English. So, hello everybody, my name is Ruben Kings and welcome back to more Super Mario Sunshine. Last episode, we decided to tackle on the Shines of Dupino Plaza. And today we're going to be finishing all the Shines in Dupino Plaza, including uh, the blue coins as well. So, for now we're just going to be grabbing these because... Honestly, we're almost done with literally the hub world. And... Yeah, I mean, it seems that we're pretty much wrapping up the game already. Uh, this Let's Play went pretty fast. Uh, we're actually, like, almost done. We still have one more world that we haven't... Uh, sorry, one more level we haven't uh, visited yet. Um, but overall, like, we're pretty much nearly done with this game. It's crazy how fast this uh, Let's Play went. Uh, truly, it amazes me so much. Okay, so starting out, we're gonna do some more blue coin stuff because, uh, yeah, these blue coin missions get pretty tedious, and I'm gonna, I'm just gonna go right ahead and do the hardest one because I know it's gonna take a pretty long time, and you have to do it three times. So, first things first, you're gonna wanna jump over here and talk to the Pianta guarding this little soccer goal thing. Hello, you want to work for me for a little bit? I'd love for you to bring me some fruit, and I'm craving some. Durians, bring me three. Just bring the fruit here and put it in this basket, okay? Yeah, this this chick wants durians. Now, I have done this mission many times before in the past, so it's not exactly, you know, undoable for anybody, but it's just tedious, okay? You could, you could literally do it so fast, but at the same time, you could also take f years, basically. <laughs> That's how it feels. So you need to get durians to this woman. And yeah, durians aren't exactly the best fruit to carry because you gotta literally kick them. So what I like to do here is I like to put it at an angle and then just dive. But some, most of the time it'll just uh, hit itself, so. Uh, we're gonna wait for it to respawn. I think that's a good angle. Alright, kick it. Yeah, sometimes these durians just kinda like have a mind on their own. There you go. And, I mean, that seems to be the easiest way, in my opinion. There's another way to do it, but I like this one personally because you just angle it and get a free shot next to the, uh, to the thing. The only hard part, though, is literally getting this fruit on top of the freaking ramp. But, other than that, this one ain't that bad. Sometimes. Urgh. No, come on. We're almost there. Abunda la caca. Wow! Oh my god, I'm so bad. Come on. Thank you, camera. Okay, yeah, maybe the, maybe this place isn't the best area for this. There you go, that's number one. Alright, cool. Yeah, sometimes these durians just kind of like have a mind of their own and they like to kick themselves uh, in places where <laughs> you wouldn't expect them to. So yeah, this, this, this blue coin isn't as hard. I feel like a lot of people just undermine the angles you can get here. But yeah, pretty much that's about it. A little bit time consuming though. Thanks for the blue coin. Thank you. We still got a lot more fruit once to go, so... Why don't we, uh... Go to this one over here. Because now you're going to play some basketball. Hello, you want to work for me for a little bit? Yeah, they all say the same thing. Okay, so now she wants a pineapple. She wants three. Alright, nice, Sue. Okay. So this woman wants three pineapple. Where can we find some? Ah, yes. Shop over here. Interesting. Can't use your nozzles when you're holding fruit, unfortunately. It would be sick, though. But this one, you do gotta play a little bit of basketball here. What I like to do is, like, line up right here and then jump. And I miss completely. But I like to line up, like, right here and then I jump. There you go, yeah. So some of these... Red co I mean, these blue coins aren't that difficult. I keep hitting the dirty. It's on my way here. They're just a little bit time consuming. Most of these are. Just gotta play around a little bit and then just. Yeah. Alright, we're gonna just one more and we're good. But yeah, overall, like. Man, I love Delfino Plaza. I can't believe we're already almost done with this game. Um, I really do hope the remake actually gets made. That way everyone can experience this game. Uh, they never got to experience it originally. 
I really do hope so, something like that happens, because, oh my goodness, this game would look so beautiful in HD. Alright, cool, we finished this one. Talk to you. Give me my blue coin. Thank you. Alright, 192. Alright, and now we have this woman over here. I believe she wants bananas, actually. Yeah, bananas. She wants three. Okay, so for this one, I just go over here. And I just go to the banana tree. <laughs> you could just go to the freaking uh, thingy. Uh, the little fruit stand. But I usually grab the one here just because it's closer. Alright, there you go. We completed this one. Just give me my blue coin. Let's see, there is a blue coin right here. Just casually there. Okay, now that we have Yoshi, let's literally eat this bird. Thank you. Get a blue coin for your troubles. Very simple. Reminder that there's only 20 uh, blue coins in this entire area, so... I'll be very cautious. I ain't gotta know when. There's also yet another blue coin up here. 196. We're nearly done, which is crazy. Let's see. And we're just missing four more blue coins. Awesome. All of Delfino Plaza, there's only four more blue coins left, and I don't exactly remember. Okay, there's one. <laughs> there's one right here. Awesome. Three more to go. Technically two. And you guys don't know why in a second. Um, as for Yoshi, I don't exactly remember where the rest of these blue coins were in Delfino Plaza. I will be grabbing these coins, though, gladly. Okay, this just leads to where the shine is. Oh yeah, wait a minute, I'm dumb. <laughs> okay, so you need to take this and go to this island. I actually started this in last episode, but I sh didn't show it off on screen. I think I already got the blue coin here. I'm super positive. Yeah, it's empty, okay. So this area in particular is... Hold on. Okay. No blue coins there. Gladly take these coins. Very nice. Okay, so... You go up here. You get a very nice high jump. Which is, I love it. Okay, talk to this woman. I believe we already talked to her, but... Yeah. Okay, she wants three coconuts. And your goal is to pretty much uh, get these off the tree. And hopefully don't get them in the water. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's not too difficult. You just gotta not be done like me. You gotta get three coconuts. I love how they're like right behind her too. So like when I was little, I would actually grab the coconuts all the way from the, uh, the island and come all the way here. Without realizing there was coconuts here this entire time. It's crazy. I love how Yoshi sticks out his tongue, too, for them. Okay, give me that. I'm gonna... He ate the coconut, you bitch! Okay. Well, it's just taking longer than it should have. Put through the tree, and we're done. That's pretty much about it. Now, there's one more blue coin. I don't exactly remember where it is, but... There's one here. Maybe it's in here somewhere. Oh, it's probably over here. Yep, okay, there's the last one. We're at 200, and there's only one more blue coin left to go. We don't exactly know where it is, because you have to basically go to the airstrip for it. And it's not that easy going to the airstrip this early in the game. Well, you pretty much go late game anyways. And guess what? We're actually at 95 coins. I didn't realize this. I was... Accidentally doing the 100 coin mission without realizing it. So I might as well get the shine and then go to the airstrip. Also, I just realized the Delfino Plaza music is not playing. Very nice. Very cool. Unintentional, but I guess the music glitched out. Give me your coins! And we got ourselves a 100 coin shine. Which for some reason decides to spawn itself all the way over here. I don't know why it does that, but sure. 
Alright, I'm gonna leave Yoshi over here. Eat your fruit, sir. Your free fruit. Okay, so while we're not able to... While we're not able to go to the airstrip, we can at least do a shine here that we haven't done yet. Because there's at least uh, a mission that I feel like it's worth noting and worth doing. Because if you look up into this little hole and you jump into it, you find yourself in a giant pachinko machine. <laughs> this level's notoriously known for being extremely buggy and annoying to do. Hopefully we can get it in one take. Or one try. Alright, there's two coins already. Three. You can luckily use your hover nozzle to uh, help you with momentum here. Now, you can technically climb your way up here and get some of the blue coins by cheesing this. Uh, but this is really difficult overall, so... It's not worth your time. <laughs> just literally just play the, the game like normal and you should be good. Uh, but yeah, your momentum does carry. And it makes this entire mission extremely... Ooh! Cheese. Do I smell cheese? I bumped into things. Oh well. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. You could just cheese this, but... Yeah, this mission's not necessarily hard. It's just annoying. You just gotta... Look at that. You gotta deal with so much jank. It's it's kind of hilarious, actually. <laughs> I almost forgot about this mission. I was about to like end the episode off too. Come on, you stupid pachinko machine! Oh, oh, oh! Oh my God, I'm soft locked. Am I? I am soft locked. There's no way. There's no way. Did I really just get soft locked here? Okay, no, thank god. Oh my god, I almost got soft luck there. I thought I was stuck. Jeez Louise. Okay, just two more blue coins. This mission is that bad. It's not that bad. It's not that bad, like I said. It really isn't. It's just annoying and buggy. This place was probably not tested too much, to be honest. Gotta, like, know when to jump. Oh my goodness. Alright, just gotta be careful. Okay, there's two blue coins. I know where they are. Just getting to them is kind of irritating. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna... I think you can just do this, honestly. Yeah, you can just do that for that one. Super easy and self-explanatory. The last one's, like, right here. I could probably climb that, actually. Super slidey game physics. No! You're kidding me! Oh my god! Okay, we're dead. Oh my god. Out of 7 out of 10? Are you kidding me? Oh my god, what is this cheese, dude? I'm dead again. I hate you, Pachinko. Fucking bitch! Yeah, there you go. And now you gotta not die. <laughs> so... Yeah, this mission in particular is not exactly super hard. You just gotta, like, not die. <laughs> Which, honestly, is the hardest part about this mission. Oh my god. Oh my god, I hate you, Pachinko! Okay, there we go. We should be good. We should be good. Yeah, alright. We beat Pachinko. Fuck this game. Oh my god. Alright, but I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Now, I don't exactly know why this place isn't opened up yet. The boat should spawn here, but it's not here yet. So, I guess next episode we're just going to open up the next area of the game. And I think that's going to be it for today. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, subscribe, and all that goodness. Once again, my name is Ruben Kings, and I hope you guys have a good one. Anyways, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.